so here's today's trim healthy lunch I'm having a large salad with some hard-boiled egg um, some grape tomatoes a little bit of mozzarella and some homemade trim healthy mama ranch dressing that is in the book or the cookbook excuse me and then I'm also having two wonder wraps so these are also in the trim healthy mama book and these are fuel pole style because I have um, lean deli turkey and some mustard on them. However, because they're paired with my S salad, it's um, in an S setting. I also have my Good Girl Moonshine and a cup of coffee. My coffee is sweetened with Truvia. So tonight's dinner is one of my all-time favorite meals. This is Bangin' Ranch Chicken. So it is basically a sauce of equal parts um, mayonnaise and Greek yogurt. 0% Greek yogurt, um, unflavored obviously, <laughs> um, and then some spices, so a bit of parsley, minced onion, and um, uh, Himalayan sea salt, some cracked black pepper, and onion powder, or garlic powder, sorry, garlic powder. Um, half a tomato sliced, and then this is cauliflower mash. So what I do is I take frozen cauliflower and I... Um, steam it, boil it, cook it basically, um, and then I chop it up with my hamburger chopper slicer thing. It's a tool. Let me show you what it is really quick. It's dirty, but this is what it is. It's um, used for grinding up uh, ground beef um, in, in a pot to make it smaller. Boy, I can't talk tonight. <laughs> um, so um, I get it small. You could use a blender or um, a hand uh, mixer or something like that. I just use that because it's really quick. And then I mix in whatever I have on hand. So tonight it was some sour cream, Parmesan cheese, um, a bit of onion powder, and um, some cheddar cheese. And I mix that all together, heat it through, and it makes it creamy and delicious and good. So that is dinner tonight, and I'm so excited to eat. Okay, so here's tonight's dinner. Sorry for the funny lighting, but um, it's just, I don't know, the lighting. So I did some roasted non-starchy veggies. So I've got um, broccoli, radish, onions, and I did some carrots for the kids, and there's also cauliflower. I just did this in a bit of some olive oil and salt and pepper um, and Italian seasoning. I roasted those in the oven. We have a pot roast, and that was done in the crock pot. And then this is a Trim Healthy Mama recipe. This is their cheddar herb biscuits. This is an S biscuit, and it's on page 197 of the cookbook. They are delicious, so I made those for myself. So if you're a Trim Healthy Mama, and even if you're not, one of my favorite sides for lunch is dill pickles. Um, so if you're doing Trim Healthy Mama, your pickles need to be dill pickles because all the other pickles have sugar added. So I like to use these as a side. They are crunchy and delicious and it's a vegetable and so good. So I'm also doing a mozzarella cheese string, a piece of chicken, and this is coated in some Greek yogurt, mayonnaise, um, parsley, and onion powder. And it's called Bangin' Ranch Chicken and it's delicious. And I need to eat because my kid's gonna be here soon. Okay, so for tonight's dinner, I am having a steak salad. So I did a really, really, really light breakfast, and I actually haven't eaten for since breakfast. Um, so I'm hungry, so this is a big old salad. Lots of romaine lettuce, a uh, handful of sliced cucumbers, some grape tomatoes, a bit of uh, marble cheese, and then the only dressing I really had on hand was Caesar, so... I have Caesar dressing and then half of a small steak. The other half is going to go towards my husband's meal. It's over here. Um, he's out for the evening, so I might add this to like pasta. Okay, hold on one second. I might add his steak to some pasta because um, we're almost out of lettuce, but he really enjoys the steak salad too. Okay, so here is tonight's dinner. So this is a pasta with a uh, Hunt's tomato sauce and a bit of sour cream mixed in to kind of cut the acidity and also to make it more like a rosé sauce. I've also added Parmesan cheese, some marble cheese, and um, 
some green onion here on top. I'll just mix that in. Um, the kiddos wouldn't have wanted that, so I did my bowl separately. And there is also chunks of chicken in here. And then I have a side of green beans. And I have a bit of butter, and then I just lightly sprinkled some garlic salt on top. So this is the dinner for tonight. The kids are also having um, slices of cheese and applesauce. Tonight's dinner is just a baked plain chicken breast with some sea salt and cracked black pepper. Sweet potato. This is just half of a medium sweet potato. Um, I didn't, they didn't cook as long as I really like them to. I really like them to be nice and caramelized. Um, and I don't know if I just didn't have the oven hot enough, but anyways, the other ones uh, did not cook quite as much as I like, so I split this uh, one with my kiddos. And then I just have some grapes and raspberries. Okay, so for tonight's dinner, I have a large salad, and that is a homemade ranch dressing. And then these are breadsticks, quote unquote. This is a cauliflower crust with cheese on top. And these are homemade chicken nuggets. And for the um, crumb topping, or what we dredged them in, was Parmesan cheese, some Italian seasoning, and a bit of oregano. So that is what is on for tonight's dinner. So tonight's dinner was super simple. I made a salad. Um, there is green onion, lettuce, tomatoes, um, broccoli, and then this is a homemade ranch dressing. And it's made with Greek yogurt and mayonnaise and some spices. And it is just so, so good. I don't know how I'll ever go back to bottled dressing. It's rock my world. And then a really quick side, I made some mushrooms. So these take less than 10 minutes to cook on the stove in some butter with some salt and pepper. It makes a really quick and easy side. And then I just have a piece of baked uh, boneless skinless chicken breast. I have some Italian seasoning on it, some um, pink Himalayan sea salt and cracked black pepper. So for lunch today I'm having a bowl of strawberries sweetened with gentle sweet, um, term healthy mama sweetener, <laughs> um, a salad with Caesar dressing, a Zevia pop, and so Zevia is sweetened with stevia. It's got no caramel coloring in it and is probably the quote-unquote healthiest sort of soda that you can have. Um, and then this right here is um, chicken with pumpkin alfredo sauce on it. So I just made an alfredo sauce. Uh, I just kind of combined some cream cheese and half and half um, mozzarella cheese, some onion, and I didn't have garlic on hand, so I just used garlic salt, some sage, and pumpkin. And I just kind of mixed it all together, and it tastes so good. It is season and taste along the way and make it to fit my palate. We had this over um, Dreamfield's noodles the other night, um, but because those don't keep very well and because, let's face it, I don't want to make a pot of noodles right now, I'm just having it over some chicken. So that is my lunch for today. So tonight we are having a Term Healthy Mama meal. This is called Bangin' Ranch Chicken in the, um, uh, what do you call it? In the cookbook, this is called Bangin' Ranch Drums. The sauce is put over uh, chicken drums. I just have it over a um, boneless, skinless chicken breast. And so the sauce is basically a half cup of Greek yogurt, a half cup of mayonnaise, some minced onion, garlic powder, um, parsley, and some salt and pepper. And it is tangy and so delicious. It's like my favorite really quick, simple, easy meal of ingredients that I always have in hand. Tonight I actually um, put some um, broccoli just right in the pan with it and added the sauce over the broccoli. The broccoli was already frozen, the chicken was already frozen, cooked it for an hour, everything came out perfectly. And then I've just added some um, fresh mozzarella cheese here on the side. Um, <laughs> it's looking a little bland and not that appetizing, but let me tell you, it smells so stinking good. So here is my e-lunch this 
afternoon. Uh, so I am doing a roasted turkey sandwich on Silver Hills sprouted grain bread. I've got mustard, I've got roasted deli meat turkey, and lettuce on my sandwich. So delicious. And then I'm also doing some oven-baked Tostitos chips and a side of pickles. These are Tostitos oven-baked scoops, and these are on plan. Um, oven, there's some oven-baked uh, tortilla chips that are on plan, and to this particular brand of Tostitos happens to be. So you can have a serving size in one E setting, and the serving size is 29 chips. So this also makes a really good E snack. Um, add some uh, Greek yogurt with some salsa, mix it together, and you have a really good dipping sauce for your tortilla chips, or you could just use salsa. Make sure that you check your salsa to make sure that no sugar has been added to it. If you are in Canada, uh, the President's Choice brand of salsa is a good one to get because it doesn't have added sugar. Just make sure to check your labels. So for tonight's dinner, I was really tempted to go off plan with Trim Healthy Mama, but I stayed on plan anyways and I pulled something together within 10-15 minutes. So this is basically a deconstructed quesadilla, taco, enchilada, whatever you want to call it. So in this bowl I have a chicken breast that is cut up and I did have some already made in my fridge. This is why it's really handy to cook ahead. I threw in a, um, I put that in a pot. I also added some chopped green onion that I already had prepared as well. I threw in some salsa, some sugar-free salsa, some sour cream, also some cheddar cheese, and then I just heated that up on the stove. I continued to kind of just mix it up until everything was combined and it was heated through well. Um, and then in this bowl, I shredded up a tortilla, a Joseph's tortilla, and then I added um, some grape tomatoes, and then I added my mixture, and I also added uh, some avocado. And then I just mixed it all up, and it's basically a deconstructed sort of taco, and my mouth is watering just looking at it. I know it's probably not all that appetizing to you, um, but it's going to be delicious. And this is something that I was able to put together really quickly because I had all of the ingredients on hand and most of the items except for the grape tomatoes and avocado. All of the other veggies were already chopped. If I had lettuce, I would also have added lettuce to this to make it more of a round meal and even more filling. However, I am out of lettuce at the moment, so this is what it is, and that is dinner tonight. So it's Friday night, the kids are having mini pizzas, and I am having a large salad with some chopped up hard-boiled egg, cucumber, um, green onions, grape tomatoes, and half a piece of steak. It's just cold steak that had been left over from the other night. And the dressing is a homemade ranch dressing. So this is made with um, half Greek yogurt and half mayo and some spices, and it's delicious. So it's sugar-free. I'm having Zevia to drink, and then a big bowl of French onion soup, and this is all Trim Healthy Mama. So here's my lunch for today. I am having a bowl of cauliflower soup. It is so delicious. It's a Trim Healthy Mama recipe. I'll leave the recipe link down below if you're interested. And even if you're not on Trim Healthy Mama, this is like a really delicious, um, healthy, healthy soup. And then I'm having a piece of chicken. And on here is, it's again another Trim Healthy Mama recipe. It's called Bangin' Ranch Chicken. And so the sauce on here is, um, well, you put it over a bunch of chicken, but it's half a cup of Greek yogurt and half a cup of mayonnaise. And you mix that together and you add some um, minced dried onions, some parsley and garlic salt and um, salt and pepper. And it's so delicious. It's one of my favorite, favorite meals. So I'm just having that cold and I'm having some water um, flavored with uh, one of those liquid enhancers that I always get.
Okay, so here is how my salad came out. It is just so delicious. I've got some good, um, pure, organic olive oil on here. It's really delicious. Um, and balsamic vinegar. So here's a tip about your balsamic vinegar. You want to make sure that it is under. Come on. Come on. Well, I guess you don't want to focus. Okay, there you go. You want to make sure that it is under two carbs, two carbs and under, because a lot of times um, balsamic vinegar can be filled with a lot of junk. Um, this is the Bertoli brand, and it's delicious, and as you can see, only two carbs. So, anyways, that's my salad. So I wanted to share with you what I'm making for dinner, and um, it's kind of a little wild hair that I pulled together here. Um, it's going to be a pasta dish. I have caramelized some onions, and I've got some peppers in here, and I've got my broccoli over here uh, ready to boil away. I'm going to pull these off, and then I'm going to heat up some steak get my pasta going, and then I'm going to make a white sauce to kind of go with all of this. So we'll see how this all comes together. So I've got the pasta back there, the water getting ready to boil, and I've got my steak here that I'm just kind of feeding through. It is already cooked, um, but it just came from the fridge, so I'm warming this up. Okay, so I've made sort of a quick bechamel sauce-ish. <laughs> um, there is some heavy cream, uh, some mozzarella cheese, a bit of Parmesan, some sour cream, and some marble cheese all mixed in here and melted together. The heavy cream just sort of thins it out. I also added in, I sauteed some garlic. I originally meant to do that, um, but garlic can be really finicky. You don't want to cook it too long. It can get bitter. So um, I just dumped it in the sauce. Now I'm going to actually add all the steak and the veggies and I'm going to drain my pasta and we should pretty much be ready to eat. Okay, so here is the final result. Um, that is a whole lot of veggies on this plate. The pasta is underneath. So with Dreamfields noodles, you want to keep it to, I believe it's a cup. So that's what I have. Um, and then there's the steak, the sauce, onions, and peppers, broccoli. I put some fresh tomato on top that'll sort of warm when I mix it all together. Some steak, and did I say broccoli? And a little garnish of um, mozzarella cheese. So that is dinner tonight. I'm so excited to dive in. I didn't really eat any lunch today, so I'm starving. But I'm excited. This is all on True Mouthy Mama. Oh.